Hey, I found the one store in the game that still had a practice kit, apparently. Stop wasting my time. Stop wasting my time. You only spent like 10,000 credits here. Seriously, why is this entire, why is this whole game act like you never, ever, 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 ever spend money in any of the stores? It's starting to get weird how none of them acknowledge that you spent money there. They're like, how dare you not spend money at my store? I'm mad at you now, even though you spent money at my store. <laughs> so we haven't been back to uh, Jensen's apartment for a while. We got it wrong, Adam. Brown's financial prospects aren't as rosy as we thought. He stands to lose trillions if the Human Restoration Act passes. That doesn't make any sense. Millions of displaced dogs will flock to Rabia. And the city can't support them. Brown's been selling investors a pumped-up dream. The corporate city-state where like-minded individuals govern themselves while investors reap the profits. Kinda goes against the idea of a one-world government. Yeah, and if it fails, so does Brown, the Santo Group, and anyone else standing in the Illuminati's way. So they want to kill a competing dream and get rid of their augmented problem in one fell swoop. I take it Brown's been campaigning against the act? And unlike Rucker, he's got the money and influence to stop it. What about the orchid sample I gave you? Marchenko's smuggling more of it into London. Were you able to analyze it? Believe it or not, it's not a bioweapon. Or at least it's not meant to be one. It's a genome editing drug. It targets the gene linked to AUG rejection and deletes it. AUG rejection? Must be why I survived. I don't suffer from rejection syndrome. What? Are you telling me you don't need neuropazine? Shit, man, that makes you... One in a billion, I know. The Orchid, Alex. You said it's not meant to be a bioweapon. Right. The files you and Janus got from the vault? They suggest Reed's team hasn't finished making the Orchid yet. It's supposed to replace the deleted gene with an artificial one, one that accepts augmentations. But until they do, it's deadly. Darknet posted pictures of Rucker's corpse. If Brown and all his elegant, fancy potential investors get dosed, and Picus News broadcasts images of them, it's gonna send a message. I'd better warn Miller. You can stay here if you want, till the curfew's lifted. I can take care of myself. But when the task force hits London, keep me in the loop. Not sure what I can do, but... Good luck, Adam. And be safe. Miller, it's Jensen. Is McCready still working on that plan for London? Because there's another variable to consider. You can brief him yourself at TF-29's airfield. We're mobilizing. Copy that. How do I get there? Damn, curfew's still in effect. So if you can get to Chicane's place, he'll fly you to it. Miller out. Son of a bitch. Can we spend five minutes without... <sighs> it's, it's a growing complaint for me. That they ever, it seems like every time I get any objective for the main story or any of the side stories, it always sends me right back to the train station over and over and over again. Which wouldn't be so bad, but the loading times are actually kind of awful. So it's a lot of loading, and then that's only exasperated by the fact that now that we're in hostile mode, uh, I have to sneak past security, which, look at that, they haven't even stopped looking for me when I first came in. That's, that's how recently I came from this location, is that they, uh, they're already sent. They're already after me this fast. I mean, they, I mean, they haven't stopped looking for me since I first came in a moment ago, and I'm about to go running back in. All right. Hop, hop, hop. Whoa, that's a high jump. Yeah. There we go. Yeah. It's like I came back for one cutscene. They're sending me back already. All right. So now we know that the. Uh, Orchid's a gene editing drug, and that the only reason that Jensen survived is because it targets a part of his genes that doesn't exist. Awfully convenient, convenient, isn't it? Uh, going back to the helipad, that means we're going here. Alright, so we should be nice and conveniently close to helipad, if I remember correctly. I believe this particular stop's nice and close. And kind of low on danger. Wait, can I hack you? Would this give me access to not having to deal with lasers anymore? I mean, it's not really worth the effort, I can just crouch. But that's neat. Kinda wish I would picked up on that sooner, if that's the case. Uh, it's not that big of a deal to crouch a little bit. Uh, so I'll pass on my right. Probably just gonna run for it, because it's kind of annoying to deal with all the security. So I need to go around the corner, past the, ca past the coffee shop. Yep. Spooky, spooky, they can't see me, woo! 
they kind of see me. They're shooting at me a lot. Ah. Uh, they seem to see me, actually. This is alarming. Alright, I'm free. Everything's fine. They'll never catch me past all these doors. <laughs> it's a good thing Adam Jensen's apparently impervious to bullets while invisible. Alright. Howdy. Chicane. Oh, I'm on top of your... Sorry. Hello, Chicane. Last time I saw you, you had a serious case of glitter hair. Admittedly, it's not completely gone. This game renders your hair really strangely. And if you press the wrong button on any of the menus, it completely loses its mind. Miller's not here yet? He's already left for the main hangars with McCready's team. We're supposed to rendezvous with them there. You ready to go? Warning! All unfinished side missions will be cancelled if you leave. Are you sure you want to go now? Yep, this is it. This is, uh... This game's more or less divided into thirds, I would say, and this is the end of that. So I believe this is... I believe this is just the, the last major story of the entire game, period. And then... the end, I guess. And, uh... I guess at that point we will move on to any of the weird DLC side story things and move on and... And, uh... Frankly, by the time you're even seeing this, it might be almost time for Dishonored 2, so obviously we'll be pl being playing that, so look forward to that uh, in parallel with and or after Deus Ex Mankind Divided. Yeah, these, uh, these, all these stealth games and these stealth RPGs, they've got a grip on me lately, apparently. They're so tiled in their release schedules. <laughs> yeah, let's go. told him it's a credible threat. I understand that. There are hundreds of lives at risk. I hope you're wrong about this, Jensen. So do I. Fine. Fine. Have your men pull back until I can talk to him myself. Miller out. Change in plans. Mac, you and your team will rendezvous with our London division. Secure the perimeter until I tell you to come back in. Jensen, you and I are on the roof. Is there a problem? Map it up, gentlemen. Approaching the target building now. Get your coat. You're gonna need it. I don't have to tell you what's happening, you know the drill. There are people down there, radical, augmented people, who've been sidelined by this world and who think the only way to stop the oppression is by tearing down everything in their way. Their grievances may be just, maybe they should be heard, but never on these terms. The world may be going to shit, but we're here to stand against the chaos. Every one of the guests down there are counting on us to keep them safe. Let's make sure we do. Dr. Miller, I'm Nathaniel Brown. Thank you for agreeing to handle this discreetly. We didn't exactly have a choice. You threatened to invoke the Corporate Sovereignty Act. I gave your London division a full day to sweep for explosives. They found nothing. It's not just bombs we're concerned with. I've also replaced all the food and beverage, brought in extra guards from Tarvis Security Services, and ordered the men to work with your team when it arrives. Trust me, I'm taking this threat very seriously. Then why not cancel the event? 
This isn't the first time extremists have threatened to tear down the Safe Harbor Initiative. Pro-Og supporters think we're profiting from their misery, promoting more failures like Gollum City. While anti-Og racists can't stand the thought of any augmented person living in peace, canceling this event will only embolden all of them. The men planning to attack here tonight are no ordinary extremists. They murdered Talus Rucker, and they want to frame the Augmented Rights Coalition if their attack tonight succeeds. Is this true? How do you know it? How does it matter? We're here because of a credible threat against you and your Safe Harbor Convention. These men are out to stop you. They know you've been campaigning against the Human Restoration Act. They need it to pass. They don't care how many lives they destroy as long as that happens. But we do. It's Agent Jensen, isn't it? David Seraph told me about you. You might not believe this, Agent, but I'm also trying to save lives tonight. The lives of your people. Several members of the UN Security Council are on my guest list tonight. I plan to convince them just how wrong the act really is. Talus Rucker couldn't stop it from passing. But I can. Where are you meeting then? In a secure conference room off the reception hall. The men from your London division have already cleared it. Doesn't matter. I want to see this room myself, and I want Agent Jensen here to coordinate with Tarvos security, while the rest of my team re-examines the building. Discreetly, of course. The head of our Tarvis division is Liam Slater. He's waiting for your man to join him in the central security office. Go see him, Agent, and keep McCready and me in the loop. Mr. Brown, if you'll show me that conference room. Oh, fell for a second there. That was weird. The, uh, well, say hello. Not only is our leader guy here, also, by the way, this is the structure we saw on that hologram. That previous base that we infiltrated. But uh, also, hey, sudden surprise reappearance of Scarface Fohawk Man. The guy from the very beginning of the game, which we then had a conversation with, and then after the prologue in that conversation, he kind of just disappeared from the game, which was a weird feeling. He felt like he was going to be important, and he just never showed up until... I, d I don't think we've actually encountered him a single time up until this climax, actually. Could be wrong, but I think that's actually accurate. So obviously an attack's going to happen, and the guy that we... The guy that we met in Golem is surely going to be showing up around here. The guy that ki killed, uh... Killed Rucker. Alex, I'm at the Apex Center. Brown's got members of the Security Council here tonight. Members sympathetic to Og rights. You understand they must be protected at all costs. Janus? Were you eavesdropping on me? Uh, forgive me, but the situation did seem to merit it. Right. Well, if I need your advice tonight, I'll ask. The Illuminati already tried once to control human evolution. Having failed, it appears that some of them now are pushing for a complete eradication of your kind. We need to stop them. Brown and the people he's meeting with tonight may be the only ones who can. Adam, Janus is right. We'll see. Is it just me, or does at some point the Illuminati get to be kind of a boring villain? There is a secret society that wants to control the world. You've got to stop them with your Jensenness. They show up in other stuff too, but every time it's always like, ah, uh, I, I kind of wish I was just a. Can I just be fighting an asshole? I mean, I think I'm still going to be fighting an asshole. I'm going to have to fight the golem dude, I'm sure. But the, the context always feels odd. It also feels really weird to walk around a place like this and not expect everyone to shoot me. I'm just so used to everyone being mad at me all the time. Move away. Access to this part of the building is restricted. Security personnel only. Chief Slater is expecting me. Chief... Oh, right. He's, um, unavailable at the moment. Urgent matter. 
The urgent matter is why I'm here. I'm sorry. Who did you say you were with? I'm concerned about how he's unfamiliar with people, because that means that he, this might be a trick of some kind. Yeah. This is all a trick. Uh. Alright. I didn't. Look, I have an appointment to meet with Liam Stevens. Chief Liam Stevens. And I don't have a lot of time. Could you try him on the radio for me? I'll do better than that. You wait here, and I'll tell Stevens personally that you are here to see him, okay? All those guys backed off. Miller, McCready. Tarvos isn't letting me in. The guard I spoke to, uh, something's not right here. McCready, anyone from Tarvos security contact you yet? Negative. Which is odd, actually. Shit. The if the building's already compromised, where? Forget it. We stay on task. Jensen, get inside Slater's office and find out what's going on. Copy that. Max, send a team up for support right away. Already on the way. So all the guards are all been replaced already with traitors. This entire place is a mess. Yeah, their security never stood a chance. And as soon as I get in trouble, we're screwed, so... We're in. No problems. Gotta be very careful how we handle this, I guess. Hi. Don't mind me, just hanging out in this lobby, having a swell time. When he's not looking, I may want to disable the security camera. Maybe sneak in there and I could disable all sorts of security-related things. Clear. Clear patrol, confirm. That's surprisingly hard to do. <laughs> The timing feels weird. Everything's fine. Don't worry about it. Thought Tarvos might have been more trouble. Sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. Uh oh, camera. Wasn't thinking about it. The other camera. It's just the camera that's suspicious of me right now, though. Nothing else. It's probably for the best. Time's kind of of the essence right now, so I'm specifically ch not trying to, uh... manually hack. Although, I might have been able to do it by now. Jeez. Is that actually the secret? This is, this is probably the password, wasn't it? You're on the duty roster for Wednesday night. Once you get to the CSO, log in as new user and I'll take care of the rest of remotely. Maxim. That does not seem it was like it was necessarily the answer I was thinking of. See, no one's looking in here right now. The windows are closed. Good. Turn off the intruder tracking. Turn off the laser grid. Disable the alarm panels. Turn off every camera we can find. Sure. It's so tempting just to make the robots turn on them. <laughs> that would clear this up so much. They're probably going to attack me soon. It's not the worst conclusion. Oh, there's a vent in here. Oh, there's even an auto... They really want you to be able to do this to the point where they gave players a, uh, a, a tool to be able to hack it if they didn't have one already. What's the point of... Seriously, what is the point of destructible vents? Does anyone have an answer for me? They feel so pointless to me because you can just punch them. Hello. Weird behind area for sneaking. That seems like the way to go forward, so I just want to take a quick look back here and see what else is over here. I guess this is probably just the alternate entrance. Yeah, that's how I would have snuck it in the first place. Alright, so that that one lobby is treated as a non-restricted zone, but I think the rest of the game is going to be treated as a restricted zone. So from here on out, I'm in trouble if I get seen. We'll just have to be careful about it. I don't need no boxes. Hit. That's for the non- that's for the people that didn't augment themselves heavily enough. All right, let's look into the Tesla upgrades, because there's more of them in here. There's also Peps ones, let's see. Precision diode, narrow beam renders targets unconscious, right. Alternatively, pra uh, we got the quick fire system for Tesla, I can go for increased arc distance, fun. Dual upgrade, attack to at once. Quad upgrade, mark four people with a Tesla, that's pretty freaking cool. I'm gonna grab that just because it sounds like the coolest thing I've ever seen. There we go. Now the Tesla has a very specific purpose. 
Because until now, I already had a tranquilizer rifle, so it wasn't that big of a deal to be able to disable one guy. And it has limited ammo, so I'd be disinclined to do so. But if I can take out four people simultaneously, simultaneously clear out the entire room without it being a problem, that'd be great. Meet Liam Slater in the ACSO. It's got an X, like it's a cancelled objective. Which makes sense, because he's already been stopped. It seems like it was basically a dummy objective that only existed so that I would, uh... Seems like it was, a, I think it was a dummy objective that only existed so that, uh... I would think that the, the uh, situation was gonna continue normally, but of course it didn't. Alternatively, maybe that decision I made between two quest objectives, maybe that led to the specific outcome happening. Who is that? This place is big, huh? Who knows? Who cares? Probably. Let's see. So my goal is to get over there in Slater's office, straight across this courtyard. Get the reception. Got up on the wrong floor, mate. What an idiot. You'll get bored and leave. Everything back there is secure. Good. Word will come up soon enough that it's all over. They're talking shit about me apparently getting off on the wrong floor. His goal is just to walk away and wait for me to leave, basically. Alright. Just good to turn more of those off if I can so I don't get in trouble here. So we disabled this laser gate. He's not looking over here. He's not looking over here either. Just sneaking about. Having a swell old time. So far, this is actually still a ghost mission so far. No, it's not actually. I got detected by a camera. That's not good. I might know him. No, probably just a local worker. Still bad, obviously. Uh, this is an implication of a side path over here. Oh, that's the that's the guy that's the guard I talked to right there. So he probably would have went back there. So I can't really go there very easily. They're all dead. They're all stripped. They've all been stripped so they can wear the costumes. So now we definitely know what's going on, and it's not good. I kind of already I already knew, but now I have a specific confirmation. I should equip my stun gun. Probably gonna have to knock out this guy in the next room, and I can't do that if I don't have my gun out. Miller, McCready, I've got Tarbo's bodies up here. We are definitely compromised. Fuck! All right, men, listen up. We expected something like this. Yeah. Mac, how close are you to the CSO? Entering the stab. Oh, oh shit! Fucking doors are on security lockdown. I can't go anywhere but back. Jensen, there should be a security override switch inside Slater's office. Get in there, get the doors unlocked, and get Mac and his team moving again. Copy that. I was really hoping I could that he would slump down before anyone saw, or that I could at least take out the windows, but I don't see a switch to turn off the windows around here, unfortunately. The way I usually like to do. These guys are dead. Hydraulic pump. There we go. That might be useful. Keith. Hey. <laughs> New guy starting on Wednesday night. Transfer from Eastern European office. Thinks he's, I think he speaks English, but he can't say how good. Uh, name's Maxim. Show him to the IT offices. Get him acquainted and settled in. Cheers. What if all these messages about a new ma new employees are actually... Oh, there's the mask. That makes it pretty clear. What if, the, what if these messages about a new person getting in are all about showing how this place got compromised in the first place? Could be. Right, so I'm probably going to get discovered soon. <laughs> Not quite spotted yet, technically. Definitely getting searched right now. If they don't look in here, I might be able to get away with this for a little longer without the alarm going off. I also disabled the alarms, I think, but I'm, they might have just been local to a specific area. Is he going to look in here? He's probably going to look in here and I'm going to get in trouble, aren't I? No? Still, let's move you behind the shelf. That improves my chances a little bit, I think. There's two guys looking at each other over here. Oh, they're upstairs. Okay. There's a camera around here. Behind this thing. There it is. Uh, is there a vent behind that thing? Of course there is. There's always heavy things blocking vents. Don't they want to have a good air circulation? Why do they do that to themselves all the time? Anyway. Sure glad I picked up this skill. It's fun. 
Uh, get out of the way. Who was that son of a bitch? Who was that son of a bitch? <laughs> That's funny. All right, that's where we just got through. More corpses, huh? They really want to make sure you found the corpses on the way to the office. So I think it looks like every option I could have, looks like every path I could have taken to get here was gonna find corpses along the way to confirm that they straight up murdered everybody. That's not a good time. So this is just leaving me the same place. Is there a way up? Uh, oh, there's one up there. Stand up. There we go. Further inside. Uh, that should be his office right there. No one's looking right now. I'm close. Up. Oh. oh, camera. Shit. I thought I was in the clear. Camera isn't really... It was just suspicious, right? And it's a camera, so it's just done. Let's just close the door. See what I can get away with here. Uh, there's no... There's currently no exposed window. Okay, cool. Let's use security immediately. Liam Slater. Uh, Don McGowan. From Don to Liam. Uh, Slater, Lester Dobbs is going to be installing new antivirus software in our network. Need a security override code if you don't mind giving it to him. I uh, told him to keep an eye out of the message for you. Mind taking care of this right away. Uh, code request. For, uh, this is from Lester to Liam. Whew. Uh, uh, uh. The door is on lockdown so they can't catch me. So I take it they found the bodies. That's really funny that that led to that lockdown door being closed so they can't catch me. Can they look through the door or not? I guess I'll keep looking. Let's see, Mr. McGowan tells me you're selling fresh software, blah blah blah, system screen right now. 5359, that'll disengage lockdown. So that's how I disengage lockdown. Thanks Chief, appreciate it. Uh, from Lester to Lester, what? Hello Chief, you may have noticed a slight glitch in the security system. Looks like this was triggered as part of our weekly bug killing expedition, but I will investigate it to be sure. The system should be back online in a few minutes. So they're on lockdown. He doesn't seem to see me. I guess he's not looking through the thing. Is this newspaper new? Yeah, it's it's because time has passed again. Uh, China under fire from scientists. The scientific community is criticizing the Chinese government's decision to opt out of the Global Climate Summit, GCS, in Phnom... in in Phnom Penh, maybe? <laughs> Cambodia. China is now the sixth country to forego representation of the summit in order to attend the Safe Harbor Convention. Dr. Pilar Taran, a keynote speaker of the GCS and trailblazer in the geoengineering, stated, The Human Restoration Act will affect such a small portion of the global population, but what's happening on Earth right now impacts us all. Following the eruption of the Vilama Caldera, in 2016, Dr. Terran spearheaded the drive for radical measures to prevent climate change in Bolivia, to increase in earth the the increase in, the increase in earthquakes, the extinction of honeybees, the decrease in biodiversity, the devastation brought by rising water levels in Cambodia can be witnessed firsthand if only represent, uh, representatives would uh, would show up at the summit. LA braces for augmented games. The city of Los Angeles will increase police presence by 50% when the Augmented Game Championships kick off in mid-February. Uh, what can I say? People of sports. Augmented athletes notwithstanding. Mayor Javier Cruz declared, Barring any natural disasters, my plan will keep everyone safe. Those legs look really fake. That is not a convincing Photoshop, in my opinion. Menswear. Fucked. Oh, is that a joke? It doesn't have to feel like you're a broken machine. H2O boost enhanced water. Weird. Some weird stuff going on in here. Is it supposed to look like every single person in that crew, in that group of people, is all smiling and talking simultaneously? Shit, they're making some weird faces. Anyway, uh, luckily I'm locked in here, so no one can mess with me for a bit, so let's take a look around. 
That's the big button right there. Tarvo security guard. There they are. They got compromised fast, didn't they? Their attempt at uh, security was a hilarious farce so far. Not that hilarious in that they're all dead, but uh, otherwise, kind of funny. Alright, well, I cleared out that armory instantly. <laughs> Alright. Oh, you might have something on you? Nope. They probably stripped it all when they were impersonating everybody. 5359. Activate. My friends, there's been darkness in the world of late. But where there is darkness, there is also opportunity. And we must seize it. We are the ones who can bring light back into the world. If we must, we will take up that torch and we will make sure that all the augmented have a chance to live with dignity. I'd like to propose a toast. Miller, to McCready, CCTV shows another compromised area. Back of the house, looks like catering. I've got eyes on that area as well. It looks like our bogus Tavos units are using a guarded security door to access the reception hall. Oh, fuck! They're everywhere, circulating among the guests. What are they playing at? Why aren't they fucking shooting yet? Jensen, any sign of Marchenko or the Orchid? Negative. Neither. Miller, can you get to Brown? I'm moving to him now. But Jensen, we need to know if the Orchid is in play. Get down here, circulate and find a key to that door. One of the guards must have it on him. Copy that. It'd be easier if I knew how many guards I'm dealing with. I'll upload their patrol routes to your retina log. But we don't want all hell breaking loose down here. So take them down quietly. Mac, you rally with Jensen ASAP. I'll pick up Brown and get him safe. Good luck, man. What a fucking clusterfuck. Copy that. And Jensen, make sure you clean up before leaving the CSO. We don't need any assholes hanging about to warn their friends. Oh. They want me to take out everyone around here, huh? Interesting. We also got another practice kit again. Jeez. At some point, I'm gonna run out of things to upgrade, aren't I? Distance upgrade? Let, that's a smart thing to do. If I'm gonna have multi-target, then I might as well have the distance upgrade, otherwise... It could be hard to get, uh, four targets in line of sight at once. We're all good on this mark. Base is compromised. Got to set up somewhere else. Move to Nantes. Confirm. <laughs> Whoopsie! Invisa punch! Ha ha ha! I've done better. There's a lot going on right now. Just trying to take out some fools. It'll be fine. Possible fort confirmed. He. How's that working out for you guys? Oh, the camera spot me again. Everything's fine, everything's fine. Boop, boop. Everything's fine. Just popping everything off for a bit. There we go. How many more of you are there? Se three more? Ow. That's not good, probably. What's shooting at me right now? Is that a robot? What? I did not know the turrets had guns. Ow, I'm not, I, mean, I didn't know that the uh, cameras had guns. Okay, that's a risk I did not know I was taking. Whoops. Whoopsie. This is the first time I've had a take out all the dudes subjective in this entire game. I don't think even the other game ever had this objective. Weird. It almost does feel out of place. I've been largely getting by by not doing this. Alright, we're back in the security hub. I can use this to my advantage, hopefully. All the cameras in here are turned off. That's a start. <laughs> he thinks he's gonna guard me. How's that working out for you guys? Alright, let's see here. That'll be fun. Miller, McCready, 
All targets in the CSO are neutralized. Best put on your tux then, Jensen. Let us know when you're inside the reception hall. Copy that. So apparently, the mul it, despite being multi-target, it does still use one ammo per. So I used two just now. So those, uh, using four at a time would not last a long time. Alright, so those guys are taken out. I'm gonna find the key card to catering. Is it on one of the guards here, or is it somewhere else completely? It looks like it's way down here. How do I get down there? So I'm here. Is this where I'm trying to go? This is the new location, right? Die, wall! Nothing's really set up to guard this place. <laughs> I didn't even punch the right spot, which is kind of accepting that, apparently. What's going on up here? Is this like an alternate path I could have taken? Whoopsie. Hello, Death Vent. How you doing? Huh. Let's uh, do this real quick. If you don't mind. Thank you. Gonna have to ask you to. Oopsie. Did that turn you off for good? There we go. Ooh. There's probably a place I could have used alternatively to get around. So it's probably redundant now. Hey, Neuropazine. What am I gonna do with Neuropazine? It's the end of the game. As far as I can tell, I don't think I'll even be visiting the normal part of the game again. Can I turn you off for good or no? Oh, that's how it works, right? Maybe it'll stay off now, or maybe it'll turn off and back on in a few seconds. Oh yeah, there's the guard. There's the room with all the guards in it again. Alright. There's another computer over here. Anomaly. Wow, that was fast. Was there a Trace firewall or something? Initiated. That was close. Liam Slater building sweep. Is that what Liam Slater looks like? We get to see his face? I thought he was dead already. Maybe he... Wait, did we find his body? Maybe he was actually the one behind all this. Attention, the preliminary sweep of the building is complete and no explosive has been found. This does not mean we relax, gentlemen. Keep your eyes and ears open and scrutinize everyone. We are responsible for the safety of our guests. Lives come first. Feelings come second. If someone looks suspicious, take them aside and check credentials. If they complain, tell them to take it up with me. Everyone gets home safe tonight. Maybe he is a good guy, then. It seems that seems kind of sincere, but obviously that's also, it could also be playing a part. I get the feeling, though, that... Uh, the bomb threat may have been a ploy to keep people on guard and have people focusing on that problem and not necessarily noticing that maybe people are missing and changing and getting replaced by other people. Now everyone's dead. From Leon to Sean. No, from, from Sean to... Uh, oh, no, from Leon to Sean. Sean, Mr. Brown is asking that all food and drink from Safe Harbor event be replaced. Don't worry about Scrooge McGowan. I'll handle him. The... Uh, the safety of the guests comes first before dollars are... Uh, before dollars are cents. That's what Brown said. Hey, Chief, no worries. Better safe than sorry, right? I've been dull food. Fucking McGowan probably felt like someone walked over his grave and put in a fresh order with uh, with the caterers. Timing might be tight, but we should do. Uh, my guards, my guys tell me that the champagne's just arrived. Crates of it. So even if there's nothing for them to eat, they can all get shit-faced. Good man. Uh, thanks, Sean. Do me a favor, have a few bottles of the bubbly taken up to the VIP room. Gavin Taylor has a door code. He'll let you in. What if the champagne's poisoned again, though? We've encountered poison champagne already. It had orchid in it earlier. An exercise ball? Nuke fire software. Oh, this is a new room. Never mind. It looked like the security room we were in previously, but it's actually a different spot that's similarly filled with corpses. What level are you? Eh, a little high. I've got these for a reason, right? This will let me turn off all the cameras. Man, if I found this room slightly sooner, this whole thing would have been a lot cleaner, huh? Because then I would have been able to take out all the cameras, probably the rest of the facility that I didn't take out with the previous one. And then it would just would have been some guards. But uh, there's so many cameras about that they blew my cover pretty hard. There's one. So, so those are both off now, I believe. 
weird how this is a turret and this is a camera, but then the miscellaneous is camera and turret. It's a weird way of d listing everything. Alright. There's dead everywhere. It's a nightmare scenario for them. Is there anything stashed around in here? Reveal software could be useful. Is this the super room I was in earlier? Hello? This might be the floor above. The, yeah, this is the floor above. So all of the turrets around here should be turned off now. That's good. This room's not useful to me anymore. We need to find our way. We need to get. Oh, right, the elevator. Right. I'm thinking about finding some obscure way to get around, but just using the elevator will work just fine to getting to where the rest of the mission takes place. Cred ship. I don't know if I've used this for any of these things. But these people were decked out. Even the, even all the, uh, wow, there's just ammo everywhere. What's that, hacking software? Yep, reveal. The gold masks are just stashed everywhere. They were not particularly secretive with their, what they were up to, were they? One rifle ammo. It's all that was in the entire gun. I question that a bit. Hello, hacking software. That's probably the biggest priority item to find, is because everything else, it's questionable whether whether I'll use it or not. But uh, I burned through a decent amount of hacking. I think I remember some early part of the playthrough where I still toyed with the idea of not going heavy into hacking, but that sure as hell changed, didn't it? Hello, robot. You're out, but you're turned off. So we never found our way into that. It's not exactly held off, is it? Let's see. From Nathaniel Brown to Liam Slater. Chief, I want to thank you and your staff for the excellent performance I've seen over the past few weeks, and in particular, the performance of the last 24 hours. Threats should never be taken lightly, and your team has dealt uh, with one aimed at our event with crackerjack efficiency. Good work, sir. I expect to see... Uh, more of the same efficiency tonight. I cannot stress the importance of my meeting this evening. If anyone, if anything should happen, the lives of millions of people would be affected. Keep up the good work. Please share this with your team. Good work, boys. So he signed up with his team. Liam seems to be playing the part pretty well, if he is a traitor of any kind, but he might not be. Nathana Brown sent to everybody. As per our discussion, I am sending down an Interpol agent named Adam Jensen. I want you to extend your full cooperation. Uses expertise and coordinating security. Thank you. Okay. So. The information did go out that I was supposed to be... Why is this the only gold mask I could examine so far? It seemed like I couldn't look at the other ones. Alright, well, that's not good. And it's covered in blood. Yay. So, the message did come down. I was supposed to be let in and they were supposed to cooperate with me. But they'd already been infiltrated. And we just got here, so they just had no idea that everyone was wiped out already. A lot of blood here. Somebody probably died in this spot. It's weird how this is the one room of the entire place that has a bunch of information in it. It's like maybe I could have snuck in here and found out this information from just here and not gone through all the guards. But I think that I was probably going to get the objective to take them all out anyway at that point. Huh. This is a sight. Is there anything stashed around in here? Not really. Let's take a look at what they're reading around here. Tarvos, mission statement and company bio. Didn't really work out because they're all dead now. Deter, defend, deliver. With headquarters in London and offices all over the globe, Tarvos Security Services has solidified its position as the finest private security contractor in the world. No other security company can equal our record of success, standard in ethics, and professionalism. The company's services include public and private event security, mobile and static security, personal protection and prote uh, protective evaluations, crisis management, and surveillance. Tarvo Security Ser Services prides itself on finding the most qualified employees and treating them with respect. With some of these individuals, uh, while some of these individuals may have been previously employed with Bell, Bell, with Bell Tower, none of the no one at the corporate or executive level of Tarvo Security Services has ever worked at Bell Tower, its affiliates, or its subsidiaries. Tarvo Security Services is a wholly owned private company. So all the messages indicate that Tarvos is totally different and definitely not Bell Tower. Everything's okay here. 
but uh, I bel it's been a while now, but I think we broke into the bell t the uh, Tarvos uh, vault at one point, and there they have that's, a, that's the vent, and we basically discovered that the new Tarvos is basically bell tower with a different coat of paint. I think is what we found out from that vault at a uh, at the bank. So it bodes poorly for everyone involved. Can I nope, nope, I clicked on it correctly. Alright. Down to reception we go. Hope things work out.